Welcome back, everyone, to Dream. And by welcome back, I mean welcome. <laughs> say welcome and back. Uh, this is a indie game that came out two years ago, if I'm not mistaken. I uh, downloaded it on Steam uh, as an early access thing, and it finally got released on the 31st of July. Woo! Uh, I'm here with Glenn. Hello, ladies John, and gentlemen. And we're gonna play Dream. I uh, it's. Fully done. I'm so excited. It's gonna be great. This it's is, like this a kind of weird to see John kicking out. This it's part. a mystery first-person oh, adventure game. Oh, hour. Jesus! It's two a.m. What the hell are you doing here? Mind if I come in first? Yeah, of course. Sorry. Come in. Uh, let me grab you a towel and a cup of tea. Or do you prefer coffee this time of day? Coffee. Fuck two a.m. No one's coming into my house at two. Here you go. Dry off your me? Bed. You, John. Of course. You live in my house. You can coffee stay here forever. Places. I'm excited. It's going to be good. I'm interested. I played a little bit of, of this game back when it was in early access. Probably about two years ago, actually. Um, really liked it. The soundtrack was great. Uh, the concept's really cool. It's all about dreams, obviously, hence the name. Um, but I actually haven't played it since, and I'm really excited to see how it's changed. Also, Glenn will be our trusty feet on this adventure, because it's only keyboard. Uh, keyboard and mouse. So I will be the, the head. <gasps> we have a body, John. We do have a body. I really should turn the TV off and go to bed. All right, so I guess that's our objective. Oh wow! Wow, we have like a cool shadow. Oh, oh wow! I we have can, a like, body. See, see our body. Oh my god, we are we are a white Caucasian male. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We want to see this magazine. Yes, I do. Oh wow! Uh, oh, cook... I can rotate it. Oh my god, you oh, can like wow, freaky can... rotate it. Oh god! Uh, I don't get that. Cooking for one premiere. Wow. I feel lonely now. Well, that's another show you never finished, Harris. Oh, we have a modem. That's good. Do we have a modem? Oh, yeah, that is. Oh, yeah, this actually kind of looks like your modem. And we have a very unfinished chest set. Okay, we have a nice we table. We have a nice house. Read the letter. Oh, uh, uh, oh. You want to, or shall I? Oh, uh, God, I this guess is going to be hard first. to read. Oh, God, turn it. Okay, this is good enough. This is the last <laughs> will and testament of Edward Phillips of 60, or 665 Dreut Lane, Sunny Riverwood. Riverbed. Riverbed. I appoint Howard Lovecraft Phillips. Wow, I don't know where that name came from. As the executor of my state, I revoke all former wills. Uh, actually, don't know what that word is. Cons. Cons. You're, if there's a COD. Codicils. <laughs> or other testimony of dis dispositions by me at any time, and declare that this to be, or this to be, and contain my last will and testament. But if my said executor should refuse to allow. Or act. God, I can't read today. It's okay, uh, it's early. Predecease me or die within a period of seven days following my death. Then I appoint Charles Philip, brother, immediately following my death. I distribute my assets as such. I give my executor the following powers. Ensure I'm cre cremated and scattered with parents and siblings. Uh, the deeds to my estate and all of its belongings. The whole of my savings and the future income from my books still selling. The right to any of my published and unpublished work dated the 6th of March. So I'm assuming uh, we're the nephew? Edward Phillips. <laughs> Good job. Oh. So I'm so I'm going to assume that we're the nephew and oh, that... What is his book? Uh, I don't... We can't pick it up. Can, can I we? zoom in? Is there a zoom it's in? It's A Bloody Mystery by E. Phillips. Was he on the, he's on the front of Space Magazine. He looks a lot like, uh, looks like uh, the dude, but from, older now. No, he looks like... Uh, yeah, but yeah, I was going to say that. He looks like uh, uh, Jeff Bridges from Iron Man 1. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> oh my god, because he's got the massive beard and the bald head. It works yeah, really well yeah. for him. Wow, he's got a lot of like super awesome literary awards. I wonder what the Cube Award is for. I don't know, but he's is got a lot like of a, there, Oh, there's a crouch function. <gasps> we can read it. Award of recognition from something. All right, let's go this way, legs. For Cubes. Oh, we... <laughs> By the way, Crouch is toggles, so we can stay Crouch forever. He has a uh, shitty wine? I don't, I don't know. Uh, well, I can't exactly. Yep. You didn't there. make it any better. <laughs> no, that's scotch. It says scotch on the front. All right, this way, legs. Into We're... the bedroom. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, We're going to no. turn the light off. It'll be responsible and save oh, our wow. power. Wow, we can turn lights on and off? Oh, God. Doors push us. Oh, We that's have not... a jukebox. Fuck yeah. That's Play not saving any power. Play royalty free music, please. Okay, thank uh, I you. I think this is in game music. Weren't we just in the kitchen? No. Oh, heard... this is the laundry room. It. The no, laundry? the laundry room's in the kitchen, apparently. <laughs> I don't know why that's... Uh, it's like a modern house thing, for sure. Hold on, hold on. Let's check what's in the fridge. All right, fine. Uh, we'll look inside our maybe dead uncle's fridge. Hold on. Can we rearrange the letters? I really don't think so. It just says dream, though. I'm going to point that out. Oh, does it? There's pop, 
Old Chinese food. And some paste? Vegemite paste, I'm assuming, and beer. No, no, no. Vegemite's Australian. They, they, uh, they eat marmite. Marmaid? You mean Mar marmalade. Marmite. What the hell is marmite? I have it downstairs in what my, the fuck in is my marmite? pantry. Also, close the, fr close the fridge. Oh, You're letting yeah. all the cold air out. See, that says dream, though. D R E A M. Huh, I get it. Dream. And there's a and there's a lottery ticket. Did we win? I don't think so. All right, Total a hundred dollars, maybe. Oh yeah. Okay. Super chalk pops. Okay. <laughs> Super um, chalk pops. We we finally going to bed. I want, I want the knife. I, Give me the knife. Sadly, this is not a survival horror game, John. <laughs> yes, oranges. Mmm, great artwork. Actually, Please. I like it. Really? Nice. You like that? Yeah, it's nice, man. Fuck that. If I'm having artwork, I'm having a real artwork in my house. Uh, cl turn the light off. This is our house, I think, maybe. <laughs> what is uh what is this? Uh am I reading Road this? To Florence. Uh I feel like this might be Oh, this is like a I think like an editor thing. Or not uh, not an editor, a reviewer, uh, for his book. Okay, so am I reading this? I recommend this book most fully, yeah, okay. Um you don't have to if you don't want to. Okay, then we will not read it. Slowly walking away. Is this a different room? This is not our this is where we started. Okay. So we'll close that um, door and we'll go to bed. We should go to bed to dream. Yeah, that th I think that's a good idea. Here, I'll just uh, turn those off. Pay no attention to the jukebox, then. Nope, don't need to go to the bathroom, John. We don't need to go to the loo. This is a British game, right? Um, I okay, so I followed the developers who are, I believe, college students online, uh, and we should turn that jukebox off. It's really loud. <laughs> Fine. Uh, there's no sprint functionality, so we are not running anywhere to anytime soon. That's all right. Uh, but anyway, so I followed the uh, the people who make this game on the internets, and I believe they are British, because they say university. Well, I don't know, that could be an English term. I don't know any... Can I turn this off? Oh, like thank that. God. Alright. So, um... Yeah, okay, let's go again. <laughs> There's a ghost in this oh, house. Oh, God. Uncle's doing just fine. I think I clicked it too many times. There we go. Okay. Um, <laughs> and now it so starts I followed up again them right now. And they were like, we took a break from university to finish the game. And I was like, the only people I know who say university like that are the British. Uh, I don't know. I, it could just be like a European terminology. Are we checking these rooms? Uh, yeah, might as well. What's, what's in here? Uh, paint. Ooh, Unfinished and boxes. Room. Howard. Howard. Bedroom. bedroom. Stuff. That's our bedroom? Are we Howard? Yeah, I think we're Howard. Yeah. No uh, way. Then what? On. Can we go in there? Yeah, sure. Of course. Uh, is there a light switch? Oh, there is a light switch. Go around the door. Legs Why go. Don't you just close the <laughs> close the door. Oh God! There we go. Close the door. Both hands and neck is John. No, because we're gonna we're gonna leave. I am hands and neck. That's true. It's like playing Octodad, but except way easier. Um, uh, it's a little bit more interestingly frustrating. Because <laughs> you don't know when <laughs> yeah, obstacles are said, coming. I have no idea what <laughs> obstacles are overcoming and what you're thinking. So I'm kind of just going with the flow. It's going pretty good so far. It's, I it's think. not terrible. Really, I'm just hitting the W button. Like I'm not using the A or D at all ever. All right, we'll uh, close the door. I think this is our room. I think this is our bedroom where we're going to go. To I sleep. like the penguin ball. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, God, the we door almost it. killed us. We now. made it, guys. Gravity animals. Cool. Distressed robot labor. Coming soon. Is that really? Distressed robot labor? Dream side. Dream side. Explosion. New, oh, it's a new, it's like a band. New album coming out soon. Okay. Yeah, oh, we should turn off the lights before we go to bed. <clears throat> oh, he plays video games. He plays old school, like, 2.0 Atari, oh. looks like. Oh, disturbed robot labor. Super DX. Oh, uh, turn off the lights. Hold up, hold up, hold up. There's books. World's Greatest Dreamer, number one. Fuck yeah, World's Greatest Dreamer, hashtag number one. The Giant's Heart, Dark Light Murders. An Oculus Rift. What? Maybe, maybe it's an Oculus Rift? Oh, it is an Oculus Rift. I wonder if that's actually pertaining to the fact that we can play this game on an Oculus Rift. I wish we had one. <laughs> yeah, well, the minute you get... Okay. I have no idea how much they are, money. I think we're like 200, maybe. All right, ready to dream, John? I am ready. I'm so ready. Do you remember your dreams? Occasionally. The more, mainly the more violent ones. Really? Yeah, like wow. the nightmares. Yeah. I've actually, like, I've had a very good week of dream remembering, actually. Okay. It's been, like, this week? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Professionalism. Oh, God. I can get rid of it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Just... Everything's fine. Nothing oh, fall okay. off my desk. But yeah, actually, like, this what basically the... this entire week I've remembered pretty much all of my dreams. Well, this whole place is made out of them, so I don't know how you can uh, tell that. Uh, yeah, well, clearly I can see there's 12 billion cubes this time instead of 11 billion. <laughs> All right. C clearly, I did the mental math. Um, uh, can we leave the path? 
Yeah, you can leave. Oh, I can see my body. Oh, we can leave the path. Oh my god, John, we're leaving the path. I'm kind of enthralled with my feet. This is amazing. <laughs> just exactly what viewers say, want. I will say that there's a lot of games that do like first person and that you're just a ghost with ghost limbs. Well, I really appreciate this. To be fair, that's a lot of old games, John. Because, you know, old games didn't have the capability of like rendering body along with everything else in the Ooh. universe. Uh, I'm assuming this is oh, important. Uh, what is this? I don't know. Uh, can I take it? Nope, it's nothing. I think it's, it's, like, a, it looks it's like, like a, a book stand. Yeah, it looks like a stand for a book. Another stand for a book. Oh, maybe, maybe it's to like collect books or something from oh. the dreams that we go uh, into. Uh, it's a coin, clearly. It's like a. It's an English coin. Oh yeah, God save the Queen. Two pence. So, so yeah, I'm definitely they probably are yeah. British. Either that or they're just like you know German. Oh, oh coins. Sweet. Wait, hold on. Go back to these. Can I pick those up? Uh, I'm gonna click furiously. No, clicking okay. furiously does not work. I think this is like maybe like a trophy room. It kind of looks like it. Maybe oh, guardian quandary. Do we want to go in there immediately? Sure, let's go. Uh, nope. yeah, okay. your, body is, your body's taking you, John. Uh, oh, but I have to be the one who clicks. <laughs> My hands must be... I, I even kept the note. Oh, you <laughs> kept the note. Oh, God, no. Oh, you say that God. way too much. <laughs> it's great. It's a great There should one. be like a... Someone count how many times you said that. We'll give you like a golden sticker. Oh, God. Is this <laughs> what Boss Room Ahead gives out to our wonderful viewers? Golden stickers? Yeah. This is like first grade. I love golden stickers. They're the bomb. That's true. I remember like when you got tests back and it was like, you did great! With like a little penguin with thumbs up. Because right? penguins have thumbs. <laughs> oh, God. I also remember like third grade. I either got like... You were a smarty or you were a fireball whenever you got like above 90. Oh, fireball all the way every day. Smart? What are you talking about? Dude, I would like to be a fireball. Also, we're in a desert. Now, this is from the uh, from the pre early access stuff a long time ago. This is what I remember. Uh, it's pretty cool. I don't know if it's changed at all. And even then, I already liked it. Where okay. would you like to go, John? The catacombs, the oasis. I like how the catacombs are both directions, implying... I don't know what that implies. So, there's multiple entrances then? Except for, like, that one points what? towards Go to the other signs. Oh uh, god, the sun! The oh. sun. Uh, let's turn around like that. There we go. Uh, the hollowed, the hollow, the catacombs, the cliff, and top, cliff top, and yeah. the viewing point. All right, so take us wherever you think is good. Uh, we'll go to the catacombs this way, or the oasis. I'm not sure which we'll find first. Uh, that's true. We don't know which one's first. Oh, we can sprint now! Oh my god, in dreams we can oh. sprint. Oh, and oh, we yeah. actually, wow, we actually run. That's kind of yeah, cool. Yeah, like book it. That's really and our arms come up. I really like that. Props to the game designers. This is really nice. Wow, we really, we move fast. Thank you, game designers, for making a sprint mechanic. We just got done playing a little bit of Leviathan, the old city, where there's no sprint mechanic. It's actually the other way around, the horrible. old city Leviathan. Whatever. But there's no sprint mechanic in that game, and it makes it so much more plotting. Um, media center? Yeah. Sure, it's... let's go to the media center. We are we are children of media. It's actually really we weird to think that, like, our generation... Can I jump? <gasps> oh my god, I have jump functionality. Oh god, here we go. Oh! <sighs> Uh, ooh, old hey, TV. look, it's that robot. Oh, look, it's Robot. <laughs> I used to love that game when I was a kid. What's he doing in his junkyard? Probably with the old tube TVs, because they're all shit. Oh, I hate God. tube TVs. Oh, media, media study, study for, for study's sake. sake. What's uh, what's on this picture? All those TVs remind me of the media storage room at university. Something. It says something there. Here lies. Oh, it's a graveyard. Look at those are like headstones, and that's a tree at the end of the graveyard. Huh. I think. That's that's my running oh, theory. The uh, ball thing. Give me the ball thing. The hands must take it. Uh, oh. Junkyard. Um, you first. Junkyard. To dream of a junkyard shows you feel rejected. It also represents a desire to rid yourself of bad habits and negative characteristics. Arcade. To see or play with an arcade machine in your dream can symbolize fun times with your childhood. You may be looking for the comfort and safety of home. It also shows a playful attitude and a competitive side to you. Amps. To see musical instruments in your dream indicates the ex expectation of fun times to come. You are focused on enjoying life and all that it has to offer. The dream also represents your talents and your ability to communicate with others. Do you believe in that kind of, like... Interpretation? No, do you just believe in, like, you know, dreams or an interpretation of your own subconscious and psyche thing? Uh, I haven't remembered enough significant ones to really make an opinion. See, I kind of hope it's not, because then some of my dreams kind of point towards weird things, and I'm not quite sure. I don't know. Oh. Whoa, what the hell? Wait, let me just, let me, if we walk away, like, turn away from it. Okay. Now Nothing turn, to see now here. Now turn back. Does it? Okay, yeah, so it's like, uh, wow, that's, that's super, I the have no idea. Is, is this it's a, a sauna? sauna? Uh, do it. 
Jump, man. Jump with there, all There is a wall. Oh, is there? If you literally just can't go in any... Oh, no. Oh, what? Are we going to make... Are there, are there bugs in the fully released game? It's fine. Uh, nope, I don't think we can get in here. No okay, more. well, uh, there's a really nice looking sauna. <laughs> that we, just, we can't quite get to. I'm not sure about that. Maybe we need to, like, finish other things? Right, maybe you need something to get in. Was this where we started? Yeah. This is totally where we started. It's, you, oh, yeah, it's just the... I don't know, like... The realm of white cubes. Well, it's possible that there's, like, more than one entrance to the white cube realm. Which Let's go going? over here, I guess? You are the head. You control where we go. That's I'm true. really going forward. I... <laughs> I have, uh, jet engines for feet. Oh. Huh? A room? Oh, this is our room. I mean, minus some things, it's also in the desert, but hey, it's our room. Well, it's also minus- it's minus the Oculus Rift, but we're still a number one dreamer. By the Can way, we, we need this? to, uh, we need to end it. Alright. Uh, well. So, uh, go look at the sign, we'll just figure out where we're gonna go next time. Oh god, the, the glare! Oh, the glare, we should It's beautiful, it actually, look at that. It's- it's nice, I like it. All right, so this has been episode one of Dream. This is uh, Boss from Ahead. I'm John. I'm Glenn. And we'll see you in the next one. If you guys feel inclined to do the YouTube stuff below, do that, and we'll respond, and we'll love you. At least I'll love you. I don't know about Glenn. I make no promises about my <laughs> love, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye.